Let me ask you this. Okay. If we were there at like this wherever the Sizzlers is, would we even want to eat there versus what else? <laughs> <laughs> when we go across the street to Claim like, Jumper. Would, yeah. 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 Would Ooh, like, Claim Jumper. Would this be like when Bart took us to that restaurant and then after yeah, we yeah, ate it, across, it, it, he's like, oh, that's my favorite restaurant across the street. And I'm like, <laughs> what the f <laughs> Yeah. Welcome back to Careful Boys. Today, we're talking about things have been going pretty good for us recently. Yeah? Pretty what? damn good. In what way? So is it time for us to break down and buy a Sizzlers. <laughs> Yo, How you many? guys. Well, we're starting we've been, one. We've been talking about <laughs> Sizzler on this channel. Talk free promotion. Free promotion. Whenever we, we always, ever talked about Sizzler. We always somehow <laughs> talk about that. Sizzler. Really? It's, it's brought up from time to time. Really? Yes. The, the fans, are off. the fans, the real fans, not part of our one now. Oh, we bring it up. Yeah, we bring it up more privately. Yeah. I, I'm just saying it's a thing in our hearts, you know. Oh. Sizzlers does roll off of our tongues frequently over the 365 days. Yeah. So yesterday, Joe texts the boys and he says, "Hey, um, would anybody be interested in going in on a Sizzlers with me?" <laughs> All right, we could save the franchise. <laughs> In our group chat. Everyone, everyone was on board immediately. Immediately. Yeah. Everybody was riding On a business buying site. But yeah. where, where? In in the valley, in the San Fernando Valley. There's, I didn't even know Sizzlers <laughs> still existed, okay? But all I'm saying is with our pool, mm -hmm. with our creativity, with everything that we know, don't you guys want to be a part of saving a piece of your childhood? Yes. <laughs> That's why I said absolutely I'm in. Let's do it. Do okay. they still have salad bars? Is that still? We could, if we own it, we could make it come back if it's Probably not there. Probably pretty cheap to buy. Do you think we could put slides in there if we wanted to, because we own it. Oh, yeah. oh that's right. Yeah. Okay, so for the low, low price of $400,000, we could get a Sizzlers. Mm -hmm. $400,000. Are there any available closer to us? By I'm yeah. just asking. To be San Fernando Valley. Yeah. <laughs> that's closer than Japan. They have Sizzlers yeah, in Japan. He's, he's right. He's right. He's, good, he's a good negotiator. It's closer than Antarctica. Are you even using your brain? You're right, dude. I'm in. I actually been to a Sizzlers in Japan. I was really upset. Really? What do they call it there? It's the quality's too good. Sizura. 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 Do they got like katsu? It's, it's like has Mastro's katsu. In Japan. If it had katsu, it'd be sick as fuck. You were upset because the quality was too good. Yep. How does that work? Yeah. Because it's and why were you at a Sizzler in Japan? <laughs> I wanted a burger. Well, because Sizzlers is known for burgers. <laughs> I wanted a burger. For what Sizzlers known steaks. for? Steaks. They name for the yeah, great like steak. a little like, surf and turf, like, you know? Mediocre um, steaks. No, 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 very, thick very, steaks. Yeah. Steaks you don't even need an ounce of sauce. Oh. Not an ounce. Okay, here's Sizzler, right? Is it? Above norms or under norms? Under norms. I thought it was. You talking about the breakfast place? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the eight ninety nine. Oh, I uh, thought you meant like normal. <laughs> oh no no norms. Yeah like. Oh, okay like the restaurant. Norms, norms Carol's norms. Denny's. That's yeah. here right? You, yeah Carol's you compare norms yeah. to Denny's. Yeah. Oh. yeah. yeah. Scissors is dessert. is more like Carol's and. Oh really? so Carol's is above, above norms. Denny's? Carol's is down here, dude. Carol's is like all the way down here. It's like the dancer. Okay. It's like a dancer. Is that right? Scissors up here? Scissors like way up here, yeah. And then where's like BJ's and like Chili's? And like Real talk, Chili's is, and BJ's is up here. Really? Chili's up there? Like that far up? Chili's I don't know. Dog. I think it'd be just I maybe a few probably, notches up. I, I just neighbor. think I they the used to be here, but Sizzler's is senior citizen and BJ's That's what is I college. I thought Sizzler's was an old person That's thing. Yeah. yeah, there's a lot of Velcro it's, sounds in the bathroom. Yeah, which also <laughs> makes it way less fine dining. Okay, what about Scissors and Marie Calendars? Where's that at? Oh, I think they're, they're kind of the same. Neck and neck. Neck and neck. neck, neck. neck, neck. Oh, okay. Yeah, but sorry, Sizzlers sorry. doesn't have pies. Yes, yeah, Marie Calendars has a pretty clear brand, though, for what they. I don't know what Scissors. Scissors might have like a key lime pie or some shit. Really? Are you sure about that? I don't know. Well, back in the day, weren't they? They were one of the first places to have that like salad bar, right? That was like endless. Oh, you, you just keep going back yeah. and get just stuff. Endless. Is salad. that a Sizzlers innovation? It's that's soup plantation, no? They, they, hometown they, buffet. That's soup plantation's entire thing. <laughs> neck and neck. Yeah. Neck. yeah. That's like another brand we could revive. Like Scissors was like going to Pizza Hut, but if Pizza Hut was for kids, Scissors was for like old Red people, lobster. right? Because like it, it was a similar type of building structure. It's all coming back now. Red Lobsters is like. I never top. been in one actually. Yeah. Only their biscuits. Everything else. Yeah. Red Lobsters is also fine dining for us poor people. I've never been to one. That's why, you know, it's one of those things where um, it was unachievable. Like everyone, like in my family was like, oh, we're not going there. It's too, it's too expensive. So then 
it just stuck with me where after I've had Michelin star all that spent omakase or whatever I would never walk into a red lobster because my head was like oh that's just that's just yeah. unachievable so I never even bothered right after yeah. you had Michelin star and Omakase, you said you the red lobster was unachievable. <laughs> nah, nah, man. They won't let me in. It's too. It's, it's, it's like it, it wasn't even on my radar. It's like you know when something feels out of reach, you just yeah. don't think about it. Yeah. That's how I but saw red, red lobsters. Lobster. Is like that's yeah. nuts to me, but I love it. I know, right? <laughs> Uh, no, but you were, so what gave you this idea of, of well, I, what were you doing? I, I'm, I mean, I'm, <laughs> yeah, what were you yeah, doing? Yeah, yeah. That context matters yeah. the most. <laughs> I look at businesses to buy, right? right? So then um, it just pops up. And then I just thought it would be so funny if all of us just owned the Sizzlers together. That's we worked, we worked, we worked there together. And it's already profitable. That's the thing, guys. Like oh, we're working there together. Can David be a partner, but he never ever works there? <laughs> he could run the Instagram. I like how he. I like his I brand. A Instagram. Sizzler Instagram. Yeah, I think he could run Check it out. We got the gum out of the carpet. <laughs> <laughs> Daily <Dude>. vlogs. <laughs> I guarantee you, with us and lines our, across the building, yeah. what we, we know out. about social, yeah, dude. <laughs> oh, it's like we're buying a brand just to just to have fun. Yeah, well, dude, we, can we put our name on the building too, like Magic Johnson? Oh, it's like the Careful Boy Sizzler. Careful Boy Sizzler. <laughs> Is it still profitable though? Will it be profitable Barely. after it's after ours. we got? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, after it, we it get grosses there. It grosses like 1.4 million. And it only brings in a hundred grand. Like, <laughs> how much? How much passive? How much passive? Like a hundred grand, but it grows. Grand. It's all passive. So, so we'll fire everyone, yeah, and we work it, <laughs> and our fucking it'll be even more profit. So it has nine hundred thousand worth of expenses. Holy, that's, fine. that's a restaurant. Let's oh, focus dude. on the profits. Oh, okay, then, you know what I mean? Hey, yeah. hey, that's good for a restaurant. If you could get 10% from a restaurant, you're golden. You know, there's some 15 year old right now who's like, I sh these guys are complaining about a hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> that's a lot of money. <laughs> it's fully staffed, so that means you don't have to work, all right? And um, all we got to come up with is maybe almost half a mil. Dude, we already have an arcade machine for it. Oh yeah! <laughs> all right, oh my God. imagine. Kim right. just arcade has Sizzlers. <laughs> we thing, we'd rebrand it. The thing about Sizzlers <laughs> is it's- Kim just Sizzlers? It's lacking the Come energy. <laughs> it's lacking the energy that it used to have. Like, I remember when I was a kid, <laughs> And that was like describe the experience. Up. You're walking through the door. It's your birthday, or you want a recital, or something. Mm -hmm. Or your parents found a coupon. They're like, dress up. We're going fancy. We're going that's, Sizzlers. Yeah, that's yeah. why. <laughs> and I remember when I said in the group chat, I was like, dude, like, do you guys remember it being like, like a big thing? Like we dressed up and we went to a Sizzlers. <laughs> it was like a, we we had to put on a collared shirt and then put cufflinks like, on you. Yeah. That was Outback for me. Wow. Outback. Outback was huge. Outback huge. was a. Was the thing. Was it was not I only Sizzlers. ate it once and I threw up like crazy. So I never ate there again. <laughs> I don't know. I had food poisoning. I don't know. I was like, oh, I'm not going to eat here again. What if we brought class back to Sizzlers? Like, class? Yeah, there's Are a we the ones code? to do that? Yeah, like the class of 98. <laughs> did it ever have class? I'm still I, trying I, to understand. Okay. I remember I remember a time that it did, all right? I feel like. I have fond memories up until junior high, and then I think a lot of Sizzlers just disappeared after that. I stopped going. Yeah. And then I'm surprised that it's still there. Another restaurant was, uh, I mentioned, is Tony Roma's. That was oh, a big Tony one. Roma. Tony Roma's, yeah, yeah that was pretty good. Tony Roma's beef ribs, all that. Yeah. But I swear it used to taste better, because I recently went and I was like, what the fuck is this? Mm. It went to Denny's level. Which one did you go to? Uh, Vegas, the one in downtown. But is that just we were kids? Cause like yeah. when I was a kid, went to Pizza Hut. It's like eating gold, <laughs> right? Gold. It was like unbelievable. Best pizza I had in my whole pizza life. Pizza at Pizza Hut was amazing with yeah. the lamps and shit. Yeah. Oh my yeah. god, forget it. Oh, the stained glass lamp. Yeah, yeah. And then you play Ninja Turtles and the friends. dessert pizza, the crispy one with the cinnamon and the frosting on it. And you dressed up for it. You dressed up to go to go to Pizza Hut. Cufflinks came out again. Right? Now you're in your fucking jammies and you just don't want to be seen in there. Oh yeah. And you're yeah. getting in and getting you out. You just get it's it. It's very to go. different now. Yeah. I feel like our imaginations were just way better as kids. <laughs> These restaurants were more than they really were. Mm -hmm. 
I remember putting on a clip-on bow tie and everything. Bow tie. And going, yeah. Let's go to Sizzlers. You remember getting dressed more than the food. Yeah. You're you're more dressed than the Mater D. I'm like Joe. Describe the experience. You're like I'm getting a bow tie. <laughs> I put my top hat on. I'm, I just, my cane? Yeah, I'm like, okay. <laughs> well, we had to prep for the food, though. I remember. It's like, we're putting on the good clothes and we're going to some. And then party. what happens when you're there? I don't even remember what the food was, to be honest. Out of, out of the scale of one to ten, how serious are you about getting a scissor? If I had more money, yeah, let's say you do. I right? would. If you a had our money, thousand all together, percent, don't do it. I would do it. <laughs> a thousand percent. A thousand percent. I would if I. I would even. I would just get it myself. Like if. I. I think we would have a lot of fun. A San Fernando Valley Sizzler. Yeah. Nope. Look, it's only funny if we all get the Sizzlers first. Yeah, it's yeah. not funny if you get it. You get richer. No, no. <laughs> what's, the, what's the joke there? Yeah. If we have. No, I'd, I'd want to invite you guys in, yeah. but I wouldn't want to expose That's what you it's to funny. the risk. It's oh, funny yeah. if we all get in it together yeah. and we all bust. That's yeah, we all get awesome. get wrecked on the Sizzlers. And Bart yeah. tried to warn us. He's like, hundred thousand dollars of passive with all this fucking overhead. That's kind of crazy move, guys. And we're like, we believe in ourselves. Our scissors on what street? I don't know! MLK. It's in San Fernando Valley has all kinds of fucking data on there. It tells you it tells you there's manage the who the management staff is, how many part-time, how many full-time. Can we get the manager here on, on the show and ask him if it's a good let's idea? Interview, <laughs> let's interview the manager. Like, hey, let's be real, why are you selling it? Ask He's like, because it's just such a great opportunity. It's 495,000. I told you, half a million. You said 400,000. Cash flow right. is 160. It's like 999, it's still nine dollars. Welcome to the boardroom, audience. <laughs> See, that's like 10%, that's fucking crazy, dude. Yeah, gross revenue is 1.5 million, but cash flow is 160. You're putting up, that's, you're you're like putting up 900 G's to make okay. 100 G's. That's I'll tell you guys this. <laughs> it's overall, good. it's pretty good. Uh, it's a, a it, that's generational wealth though. Overall, yeah. it's a bad <laughs> business. <laughs> okay. Overall, it's so bad. <laughs> but, but for a restaurant, that's amazing. I see now. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I'm eating the vision. Yep. So she's a 10 <laughs> for a three. <laughs> so that's why it's worth it. <laughs> I don't know any restaurant, okay? That's gonna do over 15%. Do you think that the uh, Sizzler will continue to do well as time goes by? That's what I'm saying is we have to do. Oh. We, we have to go in there. <laughs> so we gotta work super hard after so putting up 900,000. You don't buy a, a fix and flip and never fix it or flip uh, it. You just, you don't buy it and park your house. I see. Let me ask you this. Okay. If we were there at like this, wherever the Sizzlers is, would we even want to eat there versus what else? <laughs> <laughs> or would we go across the street to Claim like, Jumper? Would, yeah. 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 Ooh, like, Claim Jumper. Would this be like when Bart took us to that restaurant and then after yeah, we yeah. ate across oh, the, he's like, oh, that's my favorite restaurant across the street. And I'm like, what the <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. So the way you're looking at this okay, yeah. is, okay, we yeah. we gotta do it like it's a, a um like it's a nerd makeover. Okay. So we go like in she's all that. What like queer eye? Yes. Okay. So we're like the business eye for the gay guy. Okay. You All got right. it. So, good good name. <laughs> business eye for the gay guy. Yeah. yeah. Is there a way we could do it without the money? Yeah. I think there is. Okay. <laughs> but we're going to have to take a loan. Hey, well, why don't we crowdfund it? Because it's such a bang up idea. I bet everybody can't wait to get involved. Our fans are so awesome. I guarantee you, if we do a Sizzler's crowdfunding where everybody gets together and now everyone's in on this, then we'll be $15,000 closer. Yeah. I can't wait for the Coffee Zilla video about our Sizzler. Yeah. <laughs> I actually think he'd. He, He'd support it. He might even invest it. I hope he destroys us. <laughs> I can't wait for the Graham Stephan video about it. Oh, yeah. What, what the hell were you guys thinking? <laughs> it's because they lack vision, yeah, all right? Yeah. People yeah, like that, true. they're more like... They're no-sayers. Yeah, they're like, <laughs> nah, I'd rather do something more safe. I'd rather do something more lucrative. Yeah. <laughs> more successful, you know, these idiots. <laughs> so are we going to get it? Yes. Well... If Bart wants to do it with no money out of our pockets, then we gotta risk our friends and family's money. <laughs> That's how to do it. That's That's when I mean no money, I mean I don't want I don't want to risk anybody's money. That's... Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. 
Uh, I'll put in. I'll, I'll be like David, David and I'll put in sweat <laughs> equity. How about that? Sweat. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll do sweat equity. Yeah, six person sweat <laughs> equity. That's good. All right. How about this? How about this? Okay. Are you guys down to take seller finance? I don't know what that means. Okay, that means if the the guy here is claiming that it makes a hundred, what is it, a hundred thousand dollars a year? Hundred sixty thousand. Yeah. Hundred sixty thousand, right? We tell him, put your fucking money where your mouth is. <laughs> What we'll do is in five years, be able to pay you with the passive income that it comes in. So we just, we don't make anything. We just say, hey, finance the deal. It'll take 10 years though. <laughs> Why? That's $100,000 a year Inflation. for five years. Oh. Taxes. Mm. What are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> It's California. Would you be willing to trade June B for a Sizzlers? Oh. Dude, don't make me choose. <laughs> don't make me choose, man. Well, then you could always open a June B in the Sizzlers. Oh, <laughs> shit. June I think you guys are being solid? a little too negative here, dude. That's I think man, we need to- I got your back, dude. Well, open the Sizzlers in the June B. <laughs> I think this is a sick Yo, idea. That's the weirdest branding. Junbi now offering Sizzler steaks. All right, all right, this is what we're gonna do, all right? There's so much talent in this room. We're gonna have Ryan. Okay. He's gonna redo the whole okay. interior for $2,000, okay. okay? Yeah. We're gonna have Colleen. She's gonna do the commercials. Mm -hmm. Ooh, right. yeah. We're not easy. gonna get airtime because we don't have money for the air, for the commercial so no to air. See it. But we could post it on the Sizzlers Instagram. Oh, that's really That good. we're all gonna grow. That's right? great, that's hot. That's By hot telling idea. our fans out there, mm. follow the Sizzlers uh, Instagram. Hey, go check out the new Sizzler commercial. Yeah. Right. Post it on the June B Instagram. Oh, and then funnel the fans there. <laughs> that's right. That's yeah. right. Okay, okay. Then, dude, we'll have Timmy D, and we'll have Timmy D come yeah. to Sizzlers. Yeah. Do a little meet and greet. Right. And, <laughs> and then if you're, it, if you're a Patreon you, member, you, you can go to Sizzlers and pay more for food. Exactly. Oh, that's really good. <laughs> right. And then, um, Anthony here could do the grand opening dance. Yeah. With the they, yes. they cut the ribbon like he does yeah. all like all over. He should be in like a steak costume. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'd be sick if you're in a big steak costume. A big yeah. steak costume. Yeah. Yeah. With, with just a couple breathing holes, just like two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. two what would Nick do? He would do a, a jujitsu tournament inside. <laughs> no, you know what Nick would do? He would, Real he, he wouldn't show up. <laughs> <laughs> he wouldn't be there. Uh, Bart could do like a, a protein promo. It's like steaks, right? Yep. So it's like sizzler working. flavored protein. Yeah. Bulk. We could do pro we could do barbell brigade collab. Dude, sizzler protein. Yeah. Sizzler protein. Oh, dude, you sell protein powder that tastes like sizzler steaks, yeah. dude. Oh. Ooh. No, it tastes like how sizzler smells. <laughs> like the place. Are there any more like lucrative businesses like churches for sale? Can we buy a church? Why? Because it's nonprofit. We could make a religion. Just something that's like a little bit less expensive. I'm just saying that. Look at how excited we are about Sizzler. We're talking I'm so much excited. about it. Steve can make a Sizzler coin, I would love and Sizzler. that's <laughs> that can only be used at Sizzlers. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it can only be used at Sizzlers. NFTs. Yeah. Sizzler Sizzler NFT. NFT. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta spend a certain amount, and you get the NFT. Yeah. Unlimited Dude. salad. <laughs> Dude. If you if you made a Sizzler that accepts crypto, that's fucking funny. <laughs> Because anybody with crypto is like, you know what I could do with this? <laughs> that is well, that is the only thing you do with it, really. You know, it's like just it. you take that fucking shaky video of you paying with the fucking thing, <laughs> scanning a barcode, and then telling all your other people in the community. And we have the sticker the that says accepts right. Bitcoin here. Yeah. Yeah. 95% of the scissor demographics and be like, what's Bitcoin? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta think about the future, Bart. The future. Who's got an ETF, dude? New, new. We're gonna make a new and improve. Yeah. Oh my yeah. god, dude, that's so funny. Dude, we got it, man. I like it. Just that alone, yeah. we're gonna make two million dollars, which means an extra one hundred thousand dollars. I don't know if I'm ready for that kind of wealth, man. <laughs> yeah, it's not the scissors that's gonna make us the money. It's it's having the clientele there, you know, and what we're gonna sell them on everything yeah. else. We we'll sell like yeah. yeah, like senior fucking living homes and yeah. insurance. Timeshares. Timeshares. Time <laughs> don't we know yeah. the mayor? Not, not of San Fernando Valley. Uh, we well we know a mayor. We'll have him come into the Sizzlers. Oh, yeah. Guaranteed, if we get a Sizzlers out there, we're gonna meet the mayor. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Open the new Sizzlers in Irvine. In Why do you want to do Irvine? Because we know the mayor. I think, I think people succeed oh. there usually. It's like a successful city. I like a little bit of the more like grittiness. You like more like 
I like cities. You want where, it to taste like feet. Where, no, <laughs> I, I want I want a hopeless city where we bring hope. <laughs> oh, yeah. okay. I want to be the guys that like goes into Barstow, and then revives it. You know, it's like Dangerous Minds. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I like it. Yeah. yeah. Why would you want to already go to somewhere that's already successful? Because they're not gonna even appreciate you. They're like everything is successful here. You guys are just good point. Like they're not gonna appreciate Sizzlers in Irvine. But they'll appreciate Sizzlers in, in San Fernando Valley. San Fernando yeah. Valley, dude. They'll be driving from all in the country just to see our Sizzlers. No oh, doubt. Dude. No doubt about it. It'll be so successful that all the people from sizzlers. Irvine are gonna come up just to see the Sizzlers. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they pass the other Sizzlers to come to our Sizzlers. This Sizzler is going to be the one that takes over all the other Sizzlers. Yeah, we're, we're putting Sizzler back on the map. Yep. Love it. But also. <laughs> I'm hesitating a lot. <laughs>